Hey guys, today we will make dice roll application and for this in Android Studio select new project and in new project select empty activity. Then click next, change name of our application, for example dice roll. We will use Kotlin language as a default language for Android Studio and default minimum Android version 5.0. This version will run on approximately 90 and thousands of devices. It's good. And then click finish. Preparing workspace and let's run our empty app. For this click run app. If you haven't emulator, see my video how to create virtual device. Links will be in description. Our Android device is download and then our application is launching. It's work, it's name of our application and it is a text of our application. Let's start to work. The first step we will create button to roll our dice. We will use the layout editor in our project window, click res, then layout and choose our activity main layout. Double click to this file, hide our emulator, zoom in our layout. To add button in palette, click button and drag it to our layout. Then drop it. It's our button, but it is not centered. Check that button inside constraint layout. Constraint layout is a case of our app and it is a parent view of text view and button. And we see warning our button missing constraints in constraints layout. We need to position our button. We must set vertical and horizontal constraints. To position, drag the top circle of button and drag it to bottom of our text view. In attributes, in layout, we see that top of our button is set to the bottom of text view and we haven't horizontally constrained left side of the button constrained to the left side of constraint layout and the right side of the button constrained to the right side of the constraint layout and it is centered we haven't read warning and we haven't warning in constraint widget but we have yellow warning about hard-coded text, we will fix it at the next lesson. Let's start our application and we have button in our application. In the next lesson we will change text on text view and text on the button. See you soon.